We have to ask you while we have you here, we've seen an engagement ring on Miley's finger that looks like the one, well, we're pretty sure it's the one Liam gave her. <laughs> Are you sure? We're pretty sure. What if it ain't? I don't know. That's why I'm asking <laughs> well, you. you like <laughs> Are they officially engaged? Here's what I do know. They're so happy. They're you so know, happy. That's the main thing. You know, uh, Miley and I, we always had this slogan that, you know, if you ain't happy, it ain't working. And um, just seeing these, I still call them kids. These yeah. two kids happy, you know, that's all that matters. So you as a father, would you be happy if he would, if your daughter would marry Liam? If any so. of my kids decide that they're going to have a wedding of any kind, whatever the role they want me to play, I'll be there. You know what I mean? If they want me to be the butler. That's yeah. fine. You know, whatever they, whatever they should, yeah, I might make a good preacher. Yeah. You know, and you know what? You do have practice with that now. Oh, it should. Maybe you, should, should you could be the officiant. You should marry them. That'd be very sweet. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. You recently gave out um, a shout out to Chris Stapleton on his CMT nomination. Mm, the CMT yeah. awards mm. are coming up. Is there well, any chance you'll be a part of the CMT awards? I'm going to do something at the awards. I'm really excited about it. Um, country music is in a great spot right now. There's a lot of great talent out there. Um, Chris Stapleton being one of the upfront mm -hmm. great acts that's really representing country music in just an absolute fantastic way. Uh, he actually joined me, a lot of people don't know this, but Chris Stapleton, I was in a studio about, I was still doing Hannah Montana, mm -hmm. and I'd written this song uh, for the show and about Miley the day she left for California. It's called Ready, Set, Don't Go. Right. And as I was recording the song, I heard a guy in a demo booth in uh, Nashville at the studio. I was at in a little small studio, and I said, is there any way I could get that guy to sing on this record? Who knew? It was Chris Stapleton. Wow. Chris came in and put that golden voice that he just put the sound on it, which then the record became a monster smash yeah. and uh, worldwide. And a lot of people don't know that that was Chris Stapleton singing with me on that record. Now I Later, go back Molly, to joined, to Molly joined, and then it became me, Molly, and Chris Stapleton. I mentioned it to me just uh, that was a few months ago. He said, hey, man, you remember, you're the first guy. You put me on that record, and then you took me to New York, and I did my first promo trip uh, with you in New York City. Really? And I thought how cool that he remembered little old me. Oh, know? little old you, yeah. yeah. Little old me. No he big deal. <laughs>